things are, are I think they're even better this year really? um, certainly in, in you know in, in absolute terms relative to what what what's been done in the kingdom in the past uh, the the, uh, the holiday season has just been absolutely insane it's just been amazing it's been absolutely fantastic you know, I, it, the the simple thing is that success breeds success and you know we took um, we took, it was quite a difficult decision to localize the system software into Arabic because it was a big deal, you know, you know it, 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 in terms of work and effort and time. It was a big deal to do it, but, uh, you, you know, it was, it was totally the right decision to have made. And now, you know, with all these games uh, that are now getting localized into Arabic, um, the thing snowballs, the games sell more. So when publishers now look at, look at the market and they're, yeah. they're sort of thinking about, oh yeah, that's an easy decision to make. Look at the, 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 the market potential yeah. for, for something that's localized into yeah. Arabic. So um, it's, it's, it's a great situation to be in where we're very, um, you know, really, really grateful to the gamers in Saudi. It's, uh, the, you, you guys are insane. You know, when, I, when I've been to Gamers Day, it's, um, uh, it, it's absolutely fantastic to feel the energy and see the passion of, of everybody there. Will so. we see you this year at Gamers? I'm going to try. Um, you, you know, I don't think the date is finally fixed yeah. yet. I think there are two um, yeah. opportunities um, early in October. So, you know, depending how it is, I'll do my best to get there because uh, I, I really enjoyed it uh, and, you know, great to, great to see the market when I'm, uh, when I'm over there. It's always a privilege to, uh, to be there. It's, it's a very interesting issue and, and it really, it all stems um, from the, the increased, believe it or not, and this yeah. might it's a quite complicated story, yeah. <laughs> but um, uh, y you know, the, the, the f it all comes from the fact that the PS4 is such a powerful gaming console, and and y y you know the, the 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 sort of technical specifications and the numbers are all one thing. But what that power means is that people who make games now have the ability to depict characters and personalities. Uh, in, 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 within video games yeah. in a way that simply wasn't possible in the past. Yeah. Um, and, you know, that then translates itself into better storylines and better narrative in the games than we've ever had in the past. And I, I, I pick on God of War as a, you, you know, as a good example of this in that it, it, in, the, in the past it was a sort of basically a violent sort of slashing game, very good game, yeah. but, it, um, you, you know, in some ways quite one-dimensional. Um, and. Uh, those games tend to do less well in Europe than games that have something of a storyline and a narrative. And, and so, you know, when I now look at uh, the video that we saw of God of War on, on, on Monday night, I, I, I sense more possibilities for the game. Well, you know, the, first of all, it's great to have uh, Nintendo back as a kind of um, active, re-energized player in the industry yeah. because I think the industry is better, the industry is stronger with a with a strong Nintendo. Uh, so that's a good thing. And you know, Switch, um, it's it, and it, it's it's clearly off to a very good start. And, and you know, they're um, they're selling pretty much everything they can make, as far as I can gather. Um, but it's still very early days. Uh, it's very early days in terms of. You know, really understanding what the long-term um, uh, success of the of, of that platform is going to look like, uh, and it's still early days in in terms of us understanding how people are are, are using the switch, what they like about it, what yeah. they like less about it, uh, and you know, we will we will take those learnings and we will certainly uh, reflect carefully on them. You, you know, will that yeah. mean? Uh, uh, some some form of um, uh, of handheld device from Sony. I'm not at all sure. I'm, uh, you, you know, we have no no plans at present in that space. Um, but you know, we'll certainly look to take uh, take all the learnings we can from Switch. Y you know, we felt uh, that um, some games that we published uh, were very successful at the time, yeah. but you know, don't didn't really. Um, stand the test of time. Uh, I, I, and, and our opinion, our view was that Shadow of the Colossus is one of those uh, sort of iconic, almost timeless games that, that uh, w w you know, it wouldn't look um, it wouldn't look silly if it was remade. You know, Final Fantasy VII is another where, mm -hmm. you, you know, that, that announcement was made a couple of years ago. It's not our game, it's yeah. Square Enix's game. But there are some games that are just kind of timeless yeah. and uh, they transcend uh, individual generations. So first of all, you know, clearly when we look at the broader um, area of entertainment, uh, people 
uh, are increasingly enjoying entertainment from streaming services, you know, whether it's Spotify for music, whether it's uh, Netflix for, vi for video, or now, uh, now PlayStation now for, for video games. Yeah. And um, so, you, you know, we, we, we see that, we understand it, we have to embrace it. Um, and, you, you know, we are, um, we are in the process of doing some tests to bring PlayStation 4 games to P PS Now, because up till now, up till now, PS Now uh, has, has just been for PS3 games. So we're going to extend it to include uh, PS4 games, and we're starting to look uh, at expanding the geographic footprint um, for uh, y where we offer the service. Because at the moment it's US, uh, UK, and I think Belgium and Netherlands, because the servers can kind of yeah, work yeah. there. Um, so y you know, but you're, you're, you're right to. Um, uh, point out that there will be certain challenges when it comes to the kingdom. You, you know, with a, a very vast uh, geographical area, that's one problem yeah. uh, because the servers obviously they they, they work better with a, a certain proximity to to, to the uh, to the client device, uh, and also bandwidth is, is is another gaining factor. But you know, these um, things like bandwidth. Uh, the landscape in, in individual countries, it changes really quickly, yeah. you know, it develops. So um, nothing to announce right now and no, no immediate plans, I have to say, for the kingdom. But, you know, we, we certainly won't forget you guys. Uh, we, we, we like you a lot and uh, we, 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 we don't want you to be unhappy. It's, uh... No, I, you know, I, I just like to say, um, you know, once again, thank you for um, uh, for all the love that you guys have shown to PlayStation, uh, we really, really appreciate it. It means a lot to us. Um, and, uh, you know, we hope that from our side we can continue to make you happy for, uh, for many years to come. So, thank you.